What's up, y'all, man? It's your boy Tyshawn back from the video. Just got done eating some breakfast. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Breakfast, you feel me? Breakfast, break fast. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is, you know, because while you sleep, you're fasting. So you break fast, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> break your fast. Anyways, I just want to talk about something real quick, man. I just want to say, we are not just put here to just work a job. <laughs> I'm gonna say it again. We are not just put here to just work a job. Hold on, fix the audio real quick. We are not just put here to just work a job. <clears throat> I mean, these jobs that we do are pointless. Now, not really, but it kind of is because, for example, if if you work as a clerk at Walmart and I go buy some food, you're pretty much scanning my food. I pay for it, and then I get food. So I understand, you know, I understand that there's plenty of jobs that have a purpose, but at the same time, it's like, why are we doing this? <laughs> I don't know, man. It's like it's kind of weird because, like, when you think about it, it's like, like there are jobs that um that have a purpose and that serve a role to society, but at the same time, I feel like a lot of these jobs just drain us of our time and energy and stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> for example. I had worked at a hospital, right? And pretty much, um, I used to wash dishes. You know, I used to wash the dishes. I was a bus boy. You know what I'm saying? Pretty much, my job is to wash the sick, pa the sick patients' dishes so they can get clean plates and then get their breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So so I guess my job served the purpose, but at the same time, I'm like, bro, I don't feel like I'm put here to just wash dishes. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think I was born and my destiny is... Yes, I mean, and uh, I don't think God was like, <clears throat> "I'm going to create Tyshawn to wash the dishes." I don't think he, said, I don't think he said that. So at the same time, it's like, even though that job did have a purpose, it's like, I don't, I didn't really feel like that was what I wanted to do. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I don't know if we can maybe restructure this 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 world and and make it to where things work better for our benefit, or things work better for thing for the things that we like to do because man bro it's like most things that we do on this earth are things that we don't want to do you know what i'm saying did you want to wake up at seven o'clock and go to work no did you want to take a lunch break at 12 no did you want to leave at at three or four o'clock no did you want to um go to bed at 10 o'clock because you got work tomorrow no a lot of things that we do are things that we don't want to do a lot of things a lot of things that we do on earth are things that we don't want to do. Did you want to pay bills? No. Did you want to build your credit up? No. Did you want to do that? No. It, bro, everything that we do, or for the most part, as of right now, especially for me, are things that I don't want to do. Later on tonight, I got work. Job is a cool job, but at the same time, it's like, bro, I prefer not to be at work at 12 o'clock at night. <laughs> work until 7, 8 o'clock I mean, man, bro, I mean, it's a cool job, man Don't get me wrong, like, it's a cool job Don't get me wrong, but at the same time, it's like, bro I prefer to do things that I want to do, man And my job, pretty much, as in four I take care of, of people that's disabled I, I take care of disabled people You know what I'm saying? You know, folks with mental illness I understand that job has a purpose But at the same time, another thing about that job It, it kind of sucks because you know, because, you know, I um, have to give them med medication, like meds, you know, pharmaceutical pills, which we all know that shit don't work anyways. You know, I prefer if, you know, we could, you know, give them natural health to help cure them of their mental illness. But it is what it is. But I don't know, man. It's just, oh, my goodness, man. I'll, man, a lot, a, a lot of things that we do are things that we don't want to do. A lot of things that we do are things that we don't want to do. In this life, it's just, it sucks, man. So that's why I said, man, I'm I'm trying I'm trying to escape this shit, man. I'm trying to escape this nine to five life. I'm trying to escape this shit, man. I'm trying to escape this so hard, bro. God damn. Bro. Oh my gosh, man. It's like it's nine to five stuff, man. Jeez, Louise, dude. Man, bro, like. Whew. You gotta. You got to wake up because somebody tells you to wake up. You have to 
go to lunch. When somebody says you can go to lunch, you have to. I mean, I mean, for my job, because it's third shift, um, I can do what I want for the most part. But but before this job, you uh, wake up because somebody tells you to wake up. You go to lunch because somebody tells you to go to lunch. You leave because somebody, because somebody else tells you you can leave. You only have a certain amount of time to do what you want to do throughout the day because someone tells you, hey, you uh, you know, you know, um, better be back here at, at, at 6, 7 o'clock. It's like, man, bro, like, it's just I'm sick and tired of, like, having to do things that, some, that somebody else tells me to do. Because if I don't do it, then I'm not going to be able to live and function in this modern world because I'm going to be broke homeless or, or, or back at mama's house. Like, it just sucks, man. God dang, man. I mean, <clears throat> this sucks, man. I mean, I mean, before, back in the day, I mean, if you if you um if you if you wanted to build something, you just pretty much got the um got the ingredient well, not ingredients, but you pretty much got the items and stuff that you needed, and you pretty much built your own home. Like you built your own home, you don't got to pay no damn rent. Now I understand that's hard to do. Building is not easy. Um, it's, I'm pretty sure it's hard to do that. <clears throat> Um, stuff like that, but you build your own home, no more rent. And back then, you know, we uh had to hunt our own food. That I know, I know that's hard as hell too to hunt some shit. It's not easy. See, nowadays we got guns, so so anytime an animal run by, you just bah! <laughs> easy peasy. But still back then, but still back then, you know, it was it was hard as hell to do that. So it's like, but at the same time, you feel me? It's like you pretty much didn't you pretty much didn't have to pay for anything. You know what I'm saying? Pretty much. Your well-being depended on what you did, which your own self. You know what I'm saying? Um, there was nobody to tell you what you needed to do except what you wanted to do. You know what I'm saying? It's like that was that, that was true freedom. Now, at the same time, <clears throat> am I saying that I want to live back then? Hell no. <laughs> ain't, no ain't no AC. Ain't no goddamn heating. You know what I'm saying? A lot of, a, life was very difficult back then. You feel me? It was very difficult. But certainly time, what I'm trying to say is it was more free back then. So so I wish that we could take that freedom from back then and apply that to modern day life. And life would be a lot better without jobs. Unless you wanted to work there because you wanted to work there. You know what I'm saying? Or whatever. I, I mean, I don't know how this restructuring of things would be like if we didn't have jobs and all this stuff like you know, at the same time, I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, like, like, I don't know how things would be like without this stuff, or, or, or if we if we change it around, like, I don't know how things would operate. But I'm just saying, like, but if um, but if we could do that, it would be a lot better, man. I mean, dang, man, like, it, like it, it just, it just sucks, man. It just, it just sucks. Like, nobody wants to go to work. Who wants to clock in? Nobody wants to clock in. I don't want to clock in. <laughs> I don't want to go to work, man. It's just, man, dude, like, it just irritates me, man. Like, man, bro, it's like, like, there's certain days where it's like, got to be at work again. Like, man, bro, you know what I'm saying? Even, even if it's a job that I like, even if I find a job that I like, I still have an issue with, with being there because I don't want to work a job. Yes, you know, the job I have, I like it. It's a good job. God bless me with this job. I feel like God blessed me with this job. But at the same time, even though I like the job, it, I still don't want to be there. It's like, man, bro, like, jeez Louise, man. Like, uh, as of recently at my job, <clears throat> I don't know, man, it's just, I don't like to have to report to somebody and all that stuff or get called into the office and stuff like that. Like, I just dislike, you know, all this, all that stuff, man. I don't know, man, it's just, man, bro, it's just pissing me off, man. Jeez Louise, man. I don't know, man. But anyways, man, that's all I want to say. You know, I'm going to go on and on and on and on, on. That's all I want to say, man. You feel me? So, your boy is going to try. Your boy is going to get about this, man. I will. <laughs> I'm going to get about this shit, man. I don't know when, but one day I will escape this nine to five life, bro. Man, bro. Jeez. Whoever made this concept, whoever did needs to get slapped. I'm sorry. That's all I want to say. I'm out of here.